On August 20th, 1962, the NS Savannah set out on her maiden voyage, a trip from Yorktown, Virginia to Savannah, Georgia, through the Panama Canal and on to Hawaii. This nuclear-powered cargo ship, the first of its kind, was built in New Jersey at a cost of $47 million. The ship itself only cost $18 million, but adding the nuclear reactor and fuel added a whopping $29 million to the price paid by the U.S. government. An allegedly civilian nuclear-powered icebreaker had been built by the USSR in 1957, and in all, only four nuclear-powered merchant ships have ever been built. Optimized for good looks and performance as a technology demonstration vessel, Savannah was not good at hauling cargo, with difficult loading and meager capacity. She served as a passenger cargo ship and then as a cargo carrier only, sailing 350,000 miles before needing a fuel change. She retired in 1971 and is now a museum ship in Baltimore. Note, the USSR and Russia have built additional nuclear-powered icebreakers. As a question for my students and subscribers, will we ever again see nuclear-powered civilian ships? Please let us know in the comments section for this video.